Father Jesus, I have come before your present another time. I come to worship you, to praise you, and to thank you through your word. And tonight, as I sit at this table, Lord, with your word, I am about to go to bed, but I just want to thank you for your love, for your care, and for your mercy. So, as according to Psalms 23 and Psalms 91, I will read a couple of scripture and give God thanks. So, in Psalms 23, it said, The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pasture. He leadeth me beside the still water. He restored my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou prepare a table before me in the presence of mine enemy. Thou anointed my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Now, my viewers, let me say this. The word surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. I am alive tonight. I am sitting before your present telling you that I am alive because of God's goodness, because of God's grace. Because of God's tender mercy towards me. I lie down in green pastures. I sleep in green pastures, in wilderness, in open field. But Jesus Christ watch over me. Jesus Christ watch over me. My viewers, the word of God to me. I once was blind, but now I can see. I was in darkness, but Jesus shine his light in my pathway that I can see clearly the difference between wrongs and right, between night and day, between light and darkness. I was in darkness. I was in prison. I said in a young age, I run away from home. I sleep in a cane field. I sleep on a house bottom. I sleep in the mud grass at root along the roadside. I sleep on people verandas. But Jesus Christ said, I will not leave you. I will not forsake you. Even to the hen, I am with you. My brothers and my sister, you have been through stuff in your life. You never understand what you were doing. You were blind because the devil of blindness, the devil has locked us up into prison. And that's why the things that we have done in our life, they never mean anything to us. How many houses you break into? How many cars you break into? How many bus stops you mash up? How many wrong things you have done? But Jesus were there guiding you and protecting you even in your wrong state. Because Jesus have a plan for your life. And he said, I will not leave you. 
I will not forsake you. Some of the things that you do, you should end up in prison. You should have died. But Jesus said, I am here to deliver you and to set you free. God is a deliverer. He is the way maker. He is the provider. And he is the problem solver. And that's why all of what we go through in life, Jesus said, I was there. I was there. Jesus is watch over us. He guide and protect us. He deliver us. And I can tell you tonight that Jesus Christ is my deliverer. And that's why in Psalms 23, it said, Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. I said, I shall live. I shall live and declare the name of Jesus. I said, I shall live and declare the name of Jesus. Because Jesus is my deliverer. He is my way maker. He is my provider. And he is my problem solver. God been good to me. God been merciful to me. God been loving to me. And God been kind to me. I said, Jesus, watch over me. He guide me. He protect me and he deliver me from the plan of the enemy. I said, no weapon that form against me shall prosper. Because I am delivered by the blood of Jesus. I am cleansed by the blood of Jesus. I am set free by the blood of Jesus. I am washed in the blood of Jesus. I am cleansed by the blood of Jesus. I said, no weapon that form against me shall prosper. I said, devil, you should have killed me when you can. In the name of Jesus, devil, you should have taken my life when you can. Because now I am covered under the blood of Jesus. I am washed, cleansed, delivered, and set free by the blood of Jesus. You have me tied up for a very long time. You have me locked up for a very long time. But Jesus was there, guiding me, protecting me, showing me signs and wonders. But you have me locked up and I could not see. But Jesus have shined his light one sweet day in my pathway and show me the way to get out of that prison, get out of that darkness. And to come into the marvelous light. I see the light. I walk out by the light of Jesus. I accept the light of Jesus. And I can see clearly. And I say the things I used to do. I do them no more. The place I used to go. I go there no more. I am a new person. A brand new person. Born in Jesus Christ. All things are passed away. Behold all things are becomes new. Jesus Christ, show me new light and I decide to walk in the light of Jesus Christ because he is my deliverer, my way maker, my provider and my problem solver. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. Where is my scripture gone? Kasa Baba Sokoto Robo Shanda. I'm going to pray, read, read Psalms 91 and I'm going to pray and go to bed in the name of Jesus. And Psalms 91 and it read, it said, He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High. My brothers and my sister, do you know where is the Most High God? Is watch over us. The Most High God is watch over us. He said, I will never leave you nor forsake you. I am always there with you. 
I prepare to dwell in the secret place of God. My brothers and sisters, I said at the age of 30, 40 year old, I could not read nothing. Nothing I could not read. Paper to me was black and white. I could see black writing and white background. I could see A, B, C, D and pronounce a few little small words. But in the name of Jesus Christ, the Spirit of God come upon me. The anointing of Jesus Christ come upon me and teaching me to read the word of God. And I promise I will read the word of God. I will testify to the glory of God that I was a dunce and the Holy Spirit teach me to read. I will stand up and tell the world, tell the nation how wonderful, how loving and how kind Jesus is to me. I said I will not die. I will live and declare the word of God. I will live and tell the world how wonderful, how loving and kind Jesus is to me. I have made a decision to serve God for the rest of my life. I don't care what the enemy threw at me. I have made a decision to serve God for the rest of my life. I don't care what man said. I know what God has done for me. I know where God take me from. I know what God delivered me from. And it made me strong. Yes, there's a time where I feel I can't even find a word to pray. There is time when I come to read the word of God. And I feel like I can't even read the word of God. But I said, devil, you are a liar. Jesus Christ have called me. He have delivered me and he have set me free to do his will. And in the name of Jesus, I will read the word of God. I will tell the nation how wonderful and loving God is to me. <clears throat> so I read. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the most high shall Abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my fortress and my fortress. My God in Him will I trust. Surely He shall deliver thee from the snail of the fall and from the knives and pestilence. He shall Cover thee with his feather and under his wing shall thou trust. Ish shield shall be thy shield and butler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the horror that fly by day, nor for the pestilent that walketh in darkness, nor for the desolate that dost thou double a waste at noon. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand. It shall not come thy day. Only with thine eyes shall thou Behold and see the reward of the wicked. <laughs> because it shall not, it, it, because thou have made the Lord thy, the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high, thine habitation. There shall no evil before thee neither shall any plague come thy dwelling for he shall give his angel charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways thou shalt bear thee up 
in thine hands, lest thou dash thy foot against a stone. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and the dragon. Thou, the young lion and the dragon, shalt thou trust. Because he have set his love upon me, therefore will I deliver him. I will set him on high. Because he have known my name, he shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him, him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation. Jesus Christ have delivered me. I said, Jesus Christ have delivered me. Nishikata, basoko todo boshikata, mando kosia kasakata baba sokoto. Jesus have delivered me. Kedebe shikata ya baba soko todo boshikata mama kosekete. I said, Jesus Christ have delivered me from the plan of the enemy. Jesus have set me free from the plan of the enemy. Jesus have break the bar that risen for me. Someday in glory, Jesus face I shall see. Glory be to God, Jesus have set me free. I can worship. I can honor. I can praise the name of Jesus. Because I know where God have taken me from. I can praise the name of Jesus. I can worship the name of Jesus. I can honor the name of Jesus. I can glorify the name of Jesus because I know why I praise God. I know why I worship God. I know why I thank God. I am alive. I am alive. Jesus was there when I dropped into that precipice. To guide and protect me. To shield me. Jesus was there. When I have. Yes Lord. When the appendix burst inside of me. Jesus was there. When I break into. That man shop 2 o'clock in the morning. And was attacked with machete. Jesus was there. In that car accident. That took the life of my mother. I was the driver. My life could have lost just the same. But God has spared my life. He was there. I was blind. I said I was lucky. But there is no such thing as luck. Jesus. When the bowel obstruction emergency operation. Jesus was there. When the clot on my lungs. Hey, bye-bye, Shakoto. Jesus was there. When the prostrate cancer, Jesus was there. Kasa ba soko todo bo shikamba soko todo bo shinda la baba soko todo bo shanda ya mama makusende. Jesus was there. Jesus was there. 
I worship you, Lord. I praise you, Jesus. I honor your name. I glorify your name, Jesus. Kasa Baba. Soko Todo Boshikataya Mamando. Jesus, tonight I thank you. Father Jesus, I thank you for your loving, tender care and mercy to me. I thank you for your loving, tender care and mercy to me. In the name of Jesus, I am asking you. God, you said if I ask anything in your name and believe by faith, that shall you do. In the name of Jesus, I come before your presence tonight. I present myself to you. And I said, Lord, hear and answer my prayer. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, hear and answer my prayer. I surrender my life. I surrender my body. I surrender my mind. And I ask you, in the name of Jesus, reach out and touch me from the crown of my head and to the sole of my feet. Wash me in the precious blood of Jesus. Sanctify me, God, and make me who you want me to be. Make me who you want me to be, Jesus. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and what you have done for me, my soul cries out, Hallelujah. Tonight, Lord, here I am before your present, I present myself as a sinner who you saved by your grace, who you saved by your mercy, and who you saved by your tender care. I am sitting here tonight. I am surrendering my life. Yes, Lord. I am surrendering my life. I am surrendering my mind. I am surrendering my body to your will and to your way. And I say, Lord, here I am. Make me usable in the kingdom of God. Make me usable in the kingdom of God. Pour out your spirit upon my flesh. I am available to you, Jesus. I am available. Lord Jesus, hear my prayer. Receive my prayer. God, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, bless me as called into the faithfulness and the humbleness of my heart. Touch me and make me whoever you want me to be. Jesus. Jesus. I, a sinner, a wretched sinner, who you meet at that crossroad and minister to me and allow me to turn from sin to the grace of God. I am walking in the calling and the purpose for my life. And I'm praying that Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you Christ Jesus, will give me direction. Let me walk not into the wrong pathway. Now walk the wrong road, but let me humble. Let me humble. Let me humble. 
Let me humble and be faithful and patient that Jesus, whenever you speak, I will hear. Whatever you command me to do, I will do it in the name of Jesus. Wherever you send me, I will go in the name of Jesus. Let the authority of Jesus Christ minister to my heart, to my soul, to my mind, and to my body and spirit. Jesus, there is none like you. There is none like you, Jesus. God, when I wasn't thinking of you, Jesus, when I wasn't thinking of you, when I wasn't thinking of you, you were thinking of me. Lord, I thank you. Jesus, I thank you. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Lord. Jesus, I thank you. Mamando Koshi Ababai Sukutu Robosh and I am Amando Koshi Ababai Sakata. Jesus, I thank you. For what you have done, I thank you. For where you take me from, I thank you. Thank you for opening my eyes and show me clearly who I am, what I am, where you take me from. Jesus, thank you. Tonight, I am praying for the world. I am praying for the people of this world that Jesus Christ of Nazareth, each and every individual right now under the sound of my voice, God, I am praying that you will touch the heart of your people. Jesus touched the core of the heart of your people under the sound of my voice. Jesus, let it not be me, my vice. They hear, but they hear from heaven. The Holy Spirit of God is speaking. Receive the word of God. Receive the prayer from God. Receive the anointing from Jesus. Receive the Holy Spirit from Jesus and search your life. Search your life. Search your life. Ask yourself a question. If God should appear right now, where would I be? What would be my answer be if God should knock on your door? Jesus, you knock on my door and I say, Lord, I am ready. I am ready to follow you. I am ready to serve you. Would you say that? If not, will you do so tonight? And said, Lord, I hear your servant. I hear your word. And I made up my mind to follow you tonight. Will you do that? If you listen to this prayer, and you make that decision to follow Jesus, I dare you to type Amen. Yes, Lord. If you make that decision to follow Jesus, if you never accept Jesus Christ, if you are a backslider, and you decide to come back to Jesus, just type Amen. God know your name. God know your number. And God know your address. 
all God is asking for is your faithfulness, your humbleness, and your honesty. You are a backslider. And Jesus is calling you. You never yet surrender your life to God. But after listening tonight, you make that decision. Just type Amen. And God will do the rest in your life. Kasalababa Sokotodobo Shanda. Make that first step and accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. Jesus wants to deliver you. Jesus wants to save you. Jesus wants to set you free. Just as the songwriter said, He set me free one day. He set me free. He break the bars that risen for me. And someday in glory, Jesus' face I want to see. I will follow you. I make a decision and the things I used to do, I will do them no more. The place I used to go, I will go there no more. I am a new creature, a new person born in Jesus Christ. Wash in the blood of Jesus. Sanctify. I am Holy Ghost filled. Water baptized. And I am running for my life. I am Holy Ghost filled. Water baptized. And I am running for my life. Will you do that for Jesus? Tonight, I said I am praying for Luton. I am praying for the people of Luton. The children of Luton, that they too will get to know you for their self. Lord, touch each and every individual, young and old. Cover them under your blood. God, tomorrow morning, most children will be going back to school. I say thank you for bringing them through the school holidays safely. And as they wake up in the morning, to go back to school. Let them wake up with a different mindset. That they're going to go into school. And behave and humble. And take in the education. To make themselves a better person. Lord Jesus I cannot do nothing. But I know a man who can. I believe and trust in him. His name is Jesus. He said call on me. And I will answer you. And show you great and mighty things. Believe in me. Believe in my word. Accept my word. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Even to the end, I am with you. Tonight, Lord, I pray for my family, my wife, my children, my grandchildren, my sisters and brothers, my nieces and nephews, and my in-laws. I pray in the name of Jesus that the hands of God the power of Jesus Christ and the anointing of the Holy Spirit will touch, heal, deliver, and set free in the name of Jesus. Power of the living God, I call upon you. Power of the living God, I call upon you. Holy Spirit of God, I call upon you. And I ask you in the name of Jesus, visit the homeless. Visit the homeless. Visit the jobless. God, those are hungry. Feed them in the name of Jesus. Make a way when there is no way. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you tonight. I thank you tonight. So Lord, I bring Pastor Ferry, Lucy Pentecostal Church, Pastor Ferry, Sister Bethel, the family, God, I bring them before you right now in the name of Jesus. And I say, Lord, thank you for their life. Thank you for placing them in Lucy Pentecostal Church to lead us. God, continue to feed them. Feed them with the right word to feed us. That we will never last nor stray, but we will be humble and faithful to you. Jesus, I ask you, Cover each and every individual of Lucy Pentecostal Church. The elders, the deacons, and the trustees. The members and the visitors. The praise and worship team. The musicians, the nurse, and the staff. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In no other name. 
but the name of Jesus. I pray tonight that the power of Jesus Christ, the anointing of the Holy Ghost, will touch, will heal, will deliver, and set free. God, hear and answer my prayer as I humble myself to you. Hear my prayer, Lord. Take over fully control. God, remember my neighbors, my giant neighbors, my surrounding neighbors, and the people of this neighborhood. Cover them under the blood of Jesus. Lord, whoever I fail to mention to you, I pray, God, that you will cover them under the blood of Jesus. Remember those who are traveling right now. Whatever way they travel, hear land or sea, God, I pray that you will deliver them safely to their destination. God, remember those are sick. Whatever they complain is, whatever sickness they're going through, Jesus, you are the healer. You are the deliverer. You are the provider. And you are the problem solver. God, make a way when there is no way. In the name of Jesus, power of the living God, I call upon you. And whatever I mention to you this evening, God, I pray you will hear and you will answer prayer. Because there is nothing I can do. And there is nothing I want to do without you. I'm saying, Lord, have mercy upon me. Grant me the ability to become humble and faithful to you. In the name of Jesus, have your way in me, I pray. To God be the glory. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. To my viewers and my subscribers, God bless you. And thank you very much. If you watch this video to the end, thank you very much. And I am praying in no other name but the name of Jesus that you'll be blessed. You'll be blessed. Your family will be blessed. And if it's the first time coming across this channel, please share this video with your friends and family. Tell your friends and family to go over and check out Bonnie2UK. It is my prayer and testimony channel. God bless you. Don't forget to subscribe. Share the video. Leave a comment and a feedback. God bless you. I will catch you on the next video. I am out. God bless. Thank you very much.